everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your first week of November reading start from the 1st through the 7th of November 2020. This is going to be for the sign of Aquarius. Let's see what is coming up for you guys for this week time uh, starting tomorrow. I will be adding oracle cards in this reading but no charms will be added so yeah stay tuned. And while I shuffle the cards let me remind you it's a general reading and it may not, it may, and it may not resonate with everyone out there so always pick the messages. If there is anything, you'll leave the rest. For personal readings, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. And you can also follow me on Instagram where I do upload daily readings. So yeah, let's dive into the reading. Let's start. What is heading towards the Aquarians for the first week of November? Let's begin. Five of Wands, Eight of Wed, Three of Wands, Waiting for something and feeling stressed around it. Whatever it is that you are waiting for, um... I feel like you know you're overthinking for some of you maybe you are going to be uh, picking up arguments with someone as well while waiting up for this you know one thing that you are waiting for be that a person relationship commitment job whatever it is that you are waiting for I, I do see that like you know for some of you maybe you are going to have a disagreement with someone around it because you they are going to say that you know you're you are you know just waiting wasting your time or something but it's like you know they are they are guiding you towards right and uh, you know and you are you know uh, looking forward to to see something from the left. So I feel like it's it's um they are trying to tell you like you know this is the right path this is the right path and you're gonna be like you know looking to the opposite path and seeing you know waiting for that something that you are waiting for to come from. So um. But I feel like, you know, I feel like, you know, the, the people that are guiding you or that are trying to tell you to, you know, follow one path, one direction. It's like, um, it's like, you know, the path that you are choosing, basically, you have to, you will have to go alone on that one path, whatever it is. Um, because it's like majority of people, I don't know what it is that you are choosing to do. But majority of people doesn't choose to do this. Whatever it is that you're planning to do, whatever it is that you're, you know, be that in love life, work life, whatever it is. Maybe you're pursuing a, you know, career, which is not usually, you know, uh, people pursue. It, it can be anything around those lines. But yes, I feel like you, know, you will have to go alone. And um, people, people don't, don't, you know, uh, support that decision of yours. Let's see more cards here. Five of Cups. And I do see that, you know, waiting on for this one thing, waiting on for this one person relationship is going to disappoint you. Um, the more you wait, the more you're going to disappoint, disappointed. The more you wait, the more you're going dis to get disappointed. King of Pentacles. But then I see someone entering in your life from that one direction that you are heading towards or that you are looking towards. And they're going to end whatever it is. Hold on. Hold on, one more card, please. They're gonna end the the wait for you. Um, it's like you know you really have to stay dedicated there because I feel like you know for some reasons I I feel like you know um, being on the waiting side I know that you will be getting disappointed during this week time, but towards the end of the week you will start. Uh, seeing some positive signs in this in this connection in this waiting period you will see, start seeing some sort of like you know it's a fade kind of image of a person coming closer to you from that direction that you are looking towards and it, it's all gonna end whatever it is that you are waiting for your wait is going to get over for sure that's what I'm picking up and you will be getting what you want what you what you expected to come from that direction it will be coming from that direction so you will be happy you will be thankful that you you stick to it you 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 know you um stay dedicated to it but it's going to be very hard for you to be very honest it's not going to be an easy thing for you to stay dedicated to that one thing that you are waiting on for one relationship that you are waiting on for um but if you do if you if you uh could sustain this passion that you have for it that uh, that love that you have for it, you will get it. Be that in love life, work life, or home life situation. Let's see some oracle cards now. Let's see what the oracle has to add to the reading for you guys. I don't know, for very few of you, I'm picking up like maybe, you know, the direction that you are looking for, the direction that you are looking at. 
uh, and maybe you are waiting on for a specific someone from that direction maybe a new person is going to enter as well like you know that can be happening for some of you as well like maybe you are waiting and wishing and hoping that something good is going to come from this direction and people are telling you no 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 don't don't go there just go to the opposite and you're choosing to stick on that one direction hoping from one specific someone but then there's going to come a lot of you know uh you know if it applies to your work life situation i feel like you, know, you will have a lot of opportunities coming from that side but if it applies to your love life i feel like you know you will be having if not that person you will be having somebody new entering in your love life as well uh with with uh, with the stability to offer in your love life so um even if you are disappointed in your person that you that they didn't show up somebody else, somebody else is definitely going to show up for you I, I that's what i'm picking up somebody is definitely showing up it can be somebody from the past it can be a new person as well whatever it is that you're hoping for maybe it's going to come in the shape of another person but i do see you getting stability whatever it is that you're waiting for uh you will get that but I, I i do see that you will be getting disappointed too so for that reason i feel like you know maybe maybe for some of you maybe it's it's going to be somebody new as well let's see whether it has to add to the reading romance number 25 lavish the one you love with personal attention and affection you are definitely getting loved after a long period of time after a long period of uh, waiting and i feel like you know um it is going to be different for different people because it's a general reading i cannot like you know say that this is like somebody new or somebody from the past because there's no you know i haven't taken clarifiers for it but yes i do see that your wish around love life is definitely getting fulfilled people are telling you not to wait on for this not to you know choose to stick on stick your eyes to this one direction but you are choosing to do so because you have a firm belief around it i feel like you know you your passion is your inner calling is asking you to stay stick to this direction and you are going to find your your romantic partner from there from that one side as well so um if you have multiple choices to choose from right now and you're choosing to wait i feel like you know whatever it is like you know even if you're waiting and if your person doesn't show up you will have another opportunity too like you know you don't have to worry around it like you know if if your person disappoints you there is another opportunity coming ahead for you so don't get worried or upset around it just just let things be and just believe that whatever comes for you is going to be good for you is going to be better for you than what you have asked for or what you expected to come partnership teamwork will give you a better result find trustworthy people by uh, people to partner with build up a talented support team i don't know i feel like you know being on the waiting journey you might find somebody new that's what i'm picking up now you know it's it's more like you know maybe you are waiting for something to happen they are also waiting for something to happen and then you you just click it can be that for some of you for some of you maybe you are going to meet a person in a scenario like this where you are maybe you know you are sitting or waiting for something like maybe a bus stop or something uh where you are waiting for your bus to come and your people are telling you and the people around you are telling you like you know the bus is not going to come on this bus stop maybe we need to go to the other direction then you're going to meet that you know one person especially if you are single that can happen um for some of you maybe you're going to you know you're going to you're going to meet somebody new in your love life uh you might get disappointed because the bus might bus might not come from that direction but yes somebody else will uh, so that that's going to show up in your love life so yeah that's what i'm picking up too so yeah it is going to be different for different people but yep that's pretty much it if uh, if it uh, you know it, it resonated with you or if you liked it do like share and subscribe if uh, you are willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till later the next reading for you guys take care bye bye